How's it going, YouTube? This is Skull, and welcome back to my Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Nuzlocke, episode 14. Remember, if you want the chance of having a Pokemon nicknamed after you in this series, make sure to answer the question of the day using hashtag QOTD in the comments. And today's question of the day is... I, uh, don't actually have one ready at the moment, so, um... So, I'll, I'll think of something in post and add it, unless I can think of something sometime during this episode and add it at that point. Anyway, we are on this new route, working our way slowly through, making our way to Heart Home City. It's a very long, very long trip, apparently. <laughs> Okay, it is raining, so I think my Bubble Beam gets a boost in the rain, I think. I'm kind of running low on Bubble Beams, though. Gotta remember that. Oh, Bronzor's down. Our team is looking really good, really strong. Shield on. Yep, stay in. I'm pretty sure Shield on's a ground steel type. Might just be a pure steel, but I'm pretty sure it's a ground steel or a rock steel or something. Either way, it's weak to this. Yep. Oh, it has Sturdy. Of course it does. <laughs> sturdy is so annoying. Okay, going for the taunt. That's fine. You're still dead. All right. Well, gotta tell you guys, I've got a new video coming out uh, later today. Today, as in the video coming out so after you've seen this I've got another video coming out in a few hours that I'm really excited to share with you guys it's uh, it's showing off a uh, holy grail sort of a thing oh we got a TM but I'm, I'm not going to spoil it for you guys but trust me you're going to want to come back and uh, watch that video because it's pretty amazing what I ended up getting hope you all enjoy it Okay, just trying to get through all these trainers, trying to just get to Heart Home City today. This Krogunk is four times weak to Psychic type attacks. So I could swap over to Mike, but I think I'll just go for Peck instead. Yeah, I'll just do that. Okay, accuracy drop, but that's okay. Yeah, there we go. All we needed to do was land one. Of course, we get a crit when we don't, when it doesn't matter. Uh, man, we're doing really good right now. Very happy. Lavender still following us. I'm going to have Lavender follow us for the rest of this episode, and then next episode. We'll swap to having somebody else follow us. Go ahead and knock this thing out. Unfortunately, I cannot run away from Wild Ponyta. They're just too fast. Which, that's fine, because I can still knock them out in one hit, get some nice XP. I'm probably going to need to grind up before I get to Maylene anyway. Although, my Pokemon are leveling up a little faster than I expected, so maybe we'll be fine. I guess we'll just have to see when we get there. Um, trainer tips. Physical special, right. Oh my goodness. I feel like there's something hidden this way. Thank you, Bidoof. I love how the people knew Bidoof is the HM slave. There's nothing this way except for berries. They knew Bidoof is the typical HM slave. That's why they made Bidoof the one. Oh, guard spec, okay. I don't think that'll really be useful, but I don't know. We'll see. I cannot get that item. I want that item! Here we go. Let's get this item and battle this trainer. I don't even mind having to battle the trainer. I really don't. We need... Oh, my poor Ponyta! Got crushed between us. Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm fully expecting for this thing to use Detect and Endure and all kinds of other moves. That'll make it really miserable. 
or faint. Faint works too. Yep, there's the detects. Yeah. Uh, okay, it's good to know that this meta type outspeeds my Shiro. Because that means that then my meta type will probably be faster than Maylene's Pokemon, too. Or at least we can hope. We'll have to see. I've been spending the last... Ever since I beat Gardenia, I've been thinking about Maylene. In fact, since before I beat Gardenia, I've been thinking about Maylene. And I'm very nervous about Maylene. I'm very nervous. That's why I keep talking about her. I'm, I'm worried. Because I don't want to lose more Pokemon. I... I would love nothing more than to get through the rest of this Nuzlocke without losing a single other Pokemon. I know that that's unrealistic, especially since this is my very first Nuzlocke, but man, I'm just so nervous. Well, I guess I can use that to change the question of the day. The question of the day today is, who is your favorite gym leader? Um, which... Uh, yeah, not just out of Sinnoh, out of any Pokemon game. Who's your favorite gym leader? And you can include trial captains from Alola if you want. Uh, my favorite gym leader is actually Skyla from Unova, from Pokemon Black and White, the flying type gym leader. I like her a lot. And I would love to hear what you guys' favorite gym leader is too. Please let me know, because I'm curious. We got a fist plate. That could be really useful if we give it to Meditite. The power of the defeated giants infuses this plate. Okay, that might come in handy. I guess we'll see. Okay, I guess that's just a shortcut. Alright, getting past all these trainers. Man, they're all black belts too. <laughs> I wonder if it would be worth it to have a Krogunk on our team, because it's like, it's weak to so many things. It's four times weak to Psychic. Um, but it's also a strong poison type, it's a strong fighting type. Is it worth it to try and get one? I don't know, the only real place to try and pick one up is the Great Marsh anyway. And it's like, like a 10% chance of getting Krogunk or something else, so. I don't know, we'll, we'll see. Honestly, my whole plan during this game is just to play it, see what the game gives me, and work with what I get. Which, hey, so far it's been great. I mean, we just caught that Abra yesterday. Uh, we really are lucky to have that. Um, yeah, we'll swap. Yeah, so far I cannot complain with the Pokemon that the game has given us. Uh, we got a wide variety of Pokemon to choose from throughout this whole Nuzlocke. So, I really cannot complain. Is this going to be Detect? Nope. No, that thing outspeeds my Staravia? Wow! Meditite's fast. Also dead. But mine's not, so that makes me... That gives me a lot of hope for Maylene. Mike grew to level 25. Wants to learn Mind Reader? Nope. Stan. We got a lot of black belts to train up against right now. Iris is already at a, a good enough level. If I were to take on Maylene right now with just Iris, I'd be I'd be happy with the level it's at. The problem is I need more Pokemon to be higher level against Maylene. So I don't know. We'll have to see how long it takes to level up all my other Pokemon. Another item. Shockwave! Okay. I might just teach that to Luxio right now. Oh, I want that. It's a full heal. Okay. Might be handy. Oh, yeah, and I gotta use an antidote on Shiro before I forget. I'm very happy that it doesn't take damage during outside of battles, because that would have been bad. I don't know if you heard in the background there, you could actually hear Ponyta going back in its Pokeball and then coming back out again in the middle of that battle transition. That was funny. Okay, some free experience. That thing outspeeds me. Okay. They did all of three damage. 
Maybe I'm not as fast as I thought. But yeah, you know, I'm 14 episodes in. I have two badges. I only have one death. So, considering it's my first Nuzlocke, I'm still feeling pretty good about how we're doing so far. It's hard to be prepared. It really is, because I don't know when boss battles are happening, like galactic bosses. I don't know when surprise rival battles are happening, any of that. Oh, this is perfect. Wow. This is just perfect. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, no, no, we're good. We're good. Okay, I'm glad that was not stab. Okay, Mike is alive. <laughs> Okay, I'm glad it's raining, too. Wow. You know, in another situation, that could have been bad. Maybe Mike... Maybe Meditide is not as fast as I thought, because it's the slowest thing on the field right now. Are you kidding me? Nicole grew to level 27. It'll be a nice day when she evolves into Lopany. Oh, at least Mike can knock these things out and apparently take hits with an asterisk. Okay, now's the point where I swap out Mike. Oh, good lord. Uh, hey, that's an... Uh, no, no, that's that's not an underlevel Gyarados. My mistake. Okay, I'm going to stay in with Shiro and go for a Bubble Bean on the Cadaver, which I think knocks it out. I'm going to swap Mike out for Samantha. Okay. These two new Pokemon on the field really terrify me. Got off an Intimidate of our own, which doesn't matter because these are both special attackers. Well, maybe not the Gyarados, but... Samantha tanks those. Samantha's alive. Kadabra's down. Oh, that's scary. I don't want to risk losing Samantha, and I don't want to risk swapping out either. I could have just used a potion, not a super potion. Didn't do the math right. That's okay. That does so much! A crit will knock her out! But I need her in so she can get an electric-type move off of this Gyarados and kill it! Do I outspeed? There's not really a perfect choice here, is there? If it crits, it crits. Oh, man. Okay, we do outspeed. And Gyarados is down. Oh, man, that was scary. That could have been bad. That could have been bad. We got through it. Yeah, yeah, flame wheel. Okay, sounds good. Oh, that was bad. That was really bad, but we got through it. We didn't lose Samantha or Mike. We need to get to Heart Home to heal up. Man, these guys were good. Oh, man. Oh, my poor heart. Hey, Samantha's evolving! <laughs> I forgot that Lexio evolves at level 30! So not only did she stay alive, she evolved into a Luxray! Added to the layout, art courtesy of Calico Pikachu. Oh man, I'm so happy. Oh man. Its eyes, it has eyes that can see through anything. It spots and captures prey hiding behind objects. Oh, man. Here we go. The city. Let's heal up our Pokemon. This is Veilstone. 
Why did I keep thinking Heart Home? Wow, I am bad. We've been to Heart Home. This is Veilstone. This is where I want to be. Hold on. How do I get to the Pokemon Center? Bear with me. That's the gym. Hang on. I'll I'll find my way to the Pokemon Center. You know, I couldn't even do this easily in the original games either, so that's my excuse. Okay. We're 15 minutes into the episode. Oh boy. <sighs> How much damage those things did to Luxio and Metatite makes me ridiculously nervous. Let's put Mike in front. See how we do against one or two of the trainers inside the gym. Again, assuming we can get to the gym, what's this place? Style shop. Right, we could change our looks if we want. I'm not going to do that right now. wonder what goes here, just randomly there. Where's the gym? Gym's up here, isn't it? Oh, it's Dawn! Hello! I just pulled her in Pokemon Masters. I'm happy about that. Skull, are you going to take the gym challenge? Gee, you keep getting tougher and tougher, don't you? Me? Well, I went shopping at the department store and... I mean, well, of course I've been working on my Pokédex. But, uh, well... I'll catch you later! Okay. Let's at least take on all the the uh, people that we can before Maylene. It looks like there's there's a lot of trainers in here actually. I'm gonna put Iris in front. I'm not gonna be stupid. Iris should take down all these guys, no issue. I think I'm gonna spend the rest of this episode taking on the trainers, see what levels all of our rest of our Pokemon are at, and then decide at the end whether we'll take on Maylene immediately next episode or if we'll grind up first. Yeah, it was it was the right decision to swap to Staravia for this instead of leave Metatite out in front. Oh no. That is something to think about is these Pokemon do have Rock Tomb. Wouldn't be an issue with Metatite, but Metatite's just too weak. Rock Tomb is definitely gonna put a hole in my plans. Uh Metatite of their own. I gotta remember, I am slower. Okay. One trainer down. Okay. Okay, we could do this. And how many trainers are in this gym? A lot, right? I guess. What have you got? Is it another Machoke? No, it's a Metatite. Okay. Are we just going to be facing a lot of Metatites this, in this gym? Because I'm okay with that. Oh man, I'm still... I'm still thinking about how we almost lost Samantha. But we didn't! Okay, and now we outspeed this Metatite. I guess all Metatites are not created equal, because I've been faster than some and slower than others. I've been slower than some low-level Metatite, and I've been faster than some high-level Metatite. I don't think I quite get it. Well, that was not the right decision. Okay, well, at the very least, Staravia can pretty much sweep this whole gym up until Lucario. This thing probably has Rock Tomb as well, doesn't it? At least I have Intimidate. That is something to think about, is I do have Intimidate. Man, 
Man, if I only landed a crit. Oh, it didn't do rock to me. It went with scary face instead. Sad attack. And my speed is by speed. I think a quick attack knocks us out here. Yes, okay. My speed is ridiculously low, though. Just something to remember. About to send out another Machoke. Stay in. Ah, just land a crit one of these times, please. Uh, this will knock it out, and then no matter what, I've got to swap out. Probably to Shiro. I'm a chop. Hey, Mike. Mike, let's see how you handle this. Level 26 Meta's height. I do outspeed. And we knock it out. Okay. 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 We could work with this. Mike and Nicole both leveled up. There we go. Wants to learn Baton Pass. Well, what would we forget? Eh, probably forget Pound. Yeah, let's forget Pound. We already have Quick Attack. It's the exact same damage. It's also physical. And it always goes first. So no reason to keep Pound and Quick Attack at the same time. Okay. I'm not going to be stupid. I'm going to... Go back to the Pokemon Center and heal up. Then I'm also going to go to the Pokemart. Buy some Super Potions. Cannot go down. Okay. <laughs> Poor Ponyta is lagging behind. What is this? Meteorite. Very nice. There's the center. Okay. So easy to get lost in this town. We just left Ponyta outside, okay. I'm kind of thinking I should put Mike ba back out in front, actually. I'm, I think I'm just going to do that. Let's just do that. Yeah, let's just do that. If somehow I get knocked out in one move, just like Badoo, then that's on me. Where's the Pokemart? Oh, it's a department store, right? We can buy X items if we want. Something to remember. Oh, I like that animation. Okay, what can we buy? Well, we got Pokecatch app. How about that? Very nice. What can we buy? Those are not items I need. Those are the X items. Do I want any of these? <sighs> I don't know. If I do, I'll buy them before the next episode. These are TMs, which I don't think I'll be using. But it is good to buy the TMs later. Like, um, late game. It'll be nice to buy those. But not right now. Well, that's weird. Look, I just want to buy, like, potions and stuff. Is, do I have to go all the way to the top floor to get those? Uh, no. Or maybe... Is there a shop on the first floor and I'm just stupid? Yeah, apparently. Okay. Good to know. Yeah, somehow I missed this. Okay, here we go. High proportions will be handy. I want at least ten of those for now. Max potions will be better later in the game. I'll just buy them later in the game. We're good on potions, super potions, everything else. Pokeballs would be here. 
We could you we could buy ultra balls. I'm going to buy ultra balls. Just so we're ready. I could have used ultra balls for that abra, come to think of it, but you know, we caught the abra in a premier ball, so it's okay. Anything else over here I want? We could buy full heals. Oh yeah, those are gonna be invaluable. I'm gonna buy 40 of them. Honestly. Okay. We're good on items. Let's go back to the gym. And take on some more trainers. Great took you on. You know, I don't think I did that right. I did not. Wait, did I? I might have. Hold on. Here we go. There, that's what I wanted to do. <laughs> Gym puzzles have never been something I've been good at. I struggled in some of them a really long time. Especially thinking about that ice one in Gen 2. Morty's gym, not Morty. Price's gym. Okay, I know I haven't taken on this trainer in the middle yet. Uh, this is the last trainer, actually. I've taken on everyone else. Let's see what level all my Pokemon are at after this guy. I'm gonna start with his own Machoke. I guess we'll see how my Metatite does against these things. Because it's possible that my Metatite can knock these out faster than my Staravia. Guess we're about to find out. No, Staravia still does more. It did go for a Leer, not an attacking move, so we're going to at least knock it out here. Gotta keep in mind that my defense is lower now. Okay. Lavender leveled up to 26. That's still not high enough. I guess we'll stay in. I'm having a hard time thinking about what these things could have that could really hurt me. Maybe, maybe, no, Vital Throw always does the exact same amount of damage. Like, that's its thing. It's like Dragon Rage. Okay. Two Leers on me. I'll be swapping out after this, but hey, at least Metatite took down two Machoke all on its own. Another Machoke, okay. Here turn Iris. I do not like Metatite being at minus two defense against physical attackers. It's just too scary. At least all they did was go for Leers. Still not knocking these things out. Oh boy. Okay, no, we're fine. Okay, that's all the trainers in the gym. I'm still not at a high enough level to be comfortable. Samantha did grow to level 31, though. So, here's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm not going to finish this puzzle today. I'm just going to go ahead and leave. I'm going to try and leave. Here we go. Okay, I'm going to go heal up my Pokemon... And then I am going to go and grind up a few levels before tomorrow's episode. Tomorrow's episode is when I will take on Maylene, the gym leader. I'm so nervous about that. So nervous, but we're gonna we're gonna do it. Our last like five or six episodes have been leading up to this. So all that's left is for us to prepare. Get as ready as we can be. Let me just go ahead and <laughs> try and leave town. Try and get to the point where we can leave town. Here we go. 
All right, so this is where I will stop this episode, is with us out here ready to grind up. So until next time, thanks everyone for watching. Looking forward to reading your answer to the question of the day using hashtag QOTD in the comments. Uh, tomorrow is the ultimate test of our Nuzlocke so far. Thanks everyone for watching and stay tuned for more.